coming up here very shortly, and we you know mentioned this going into the break. There's going to be a lot of changes to WWE TV over the next few uh, few months. Coming up September 1st, if you're an NXT fan, that is going over to the CW. Mm-hmm. And we'll talk a little bit more about some comments Shawn Michaels made about that. But then we've also got SmackDown going to USA. That starts on the 13th of September, so be ready for that. So it's all Fox going to USA. And then in January... The one that I'm still not thrilled about it, but I get it, is Raw is heading to Netflix. So start marking your calendars if you're a WWE fan because these changes are coming quick. And apparently Shawn Michaels is going to pull out all the stops for this episode of NXT debuting on the CW. CM Punk's going to be there, but not saying much else than that in an interview with WGN. Are you, you feeling this move? I mean, you you liking this going to CW? It's it's intriguing. CW is trying to, you know, they're trying to bolster their sports, you know, landscape. They've got ACC football. They got Live Golf. Um, they're I think I think oh they're uh they're gonna have the NASCAR Xfinity Series debut on the CW, which you know it's still it's on FS1, I think, right now. So they're trying, they're trying to, you know, up their sports game a bit. Now they, you know, of course they've had the NWA on, I guess it's on the CW app. So now they're going to have NXT on CW. I'll be interested to see what the presentation, how, how it changes going from USA to CW because CW is a broadcast channel. It's not a cable channel uh, here in Austin. It's uh KNVA. Uh, is the affiliate here in Austin, and so I'll be interested to see what the how the presentation changes, if any. You mentioned the thing, you know, they've got CM Punk uh, debuting when CW goes. I think there are NXT is supposed to hit Chicago on I want to say October first, and that's supposed to be this. That's where CM Punk's supposed to appear, and then the next week they're in St. Louis, and Randy Orton's going to appear, and. I mean, look, we know we know NXT. You know they like to bring in the main roster stars, especially if they want to pop a big grading. We'll see what they do. I, you know, I like the NXT. I like NXT. The stories are fun. It's it's a little bit of a mix from you know your straight wrestling and full on sports entertainment. It tries to you know go down the middle. So I'm intrigued. Um, the other changes, I mean, SmackDown going to USA, it feels like that, sh- that should have been. I don't think that's going to, they're, they're going to change much. Raw to Netflix in January. That's oh. going to be the big one. Yeah. Um, and we saw uh, they had Fanatics, Fanatics Fest up in New York, and there was a big, you know, big banner uh, touting that. Um, I'll be interested to see. You know, because, you know, in, even Triple H has mentioned about, you know, having to, you know, bleep out or, or cut audio or video whenever something that's not that they can't air airs or happens. Well, they don't have to worry about that on, on Netflix. Nope. And oh, by the way, uh, if if they find success with that. Could you Everybody. see Smackdown go to Netflix the next time? Yeah, it wouldn't shock me. It wouldn't shock me in the least. And personally, I don't have a Netflix. Just I don't reasons, either. but I guess I'm going to be having to get one. Oh, so many streaming networks. That's the thing that drives me crazy. It's just I like mean, they're they're everywhere, and it's like here's you know here's your Peacock, here's your Netflix, here's this, here's that. HBO, unfortunately, at least with my current cable package, I get HBO Max, so I've got that covered when Tony finally signs that deal. But that will be intriguing. I'm. You know, I'm, I'm sure they're going to be skewing it towards a little younger crowd. So I would imagine that the demographic, the, the way the show is going to be done might change a little, but we'll see. We'll see. Hey there, adventure seeker. Ready to unlock incredible hotel deals? Get a free membership and save up to 50%. Stay grand. Spend less. The simplest site. The best unpublished hotel deals. TheTravelShark.com